Most of us are in the 50s here. City Airport, you're at uh, 60 degrees. That's Detroit. And we have Monroe at 61. But again, most of us, mid to upper 50s, we'll call it. Let's look a little farther to the south and take a look right here south of the state line. Look at Toledo is at 63 degrees and that's a pretty common temperature right here in this chunk of northwest Ohio, northeast Indiana. What's going on is there's a warm front right here, perhaps right up at Monroe right now because Monroe was at 61 degrees and that warm front is going to come northward during the course of the afternoon. And that's really, really important. So let's show you why, because now we're into the satellite radar composite. So this, this is cloud cover here, and then you see the radar echoes here. See this little sinewy little band right here? That band right there is associated with the warm front, which I believe is going to make it northward coming up through the afternoon. So here's that new model. This is the highest resolution computer model that we have available to us. And you can see here at noon just that scattered activity, and even by three, four o'clock, you can still see some scattered activity across the area, but watch what happens as we get to the prime of trick-or-treating time, seven o'clock. I think that warm front's right around maybe M59 or so. So unfortunately for you in the north, that's a little greater coverage of showers there because you're closer to that front, but notice a break, not a break, I'll call it, just call it more widely scattered activity to the south, all this stuff ending overnight, and then the weather for the next few days is gonna be unbelievable, but for today, for most of us, it's going to be low to mid 60s, getting a little cooler to the north with those patches of light rain and drizzle. Tomorrow, we'll start with some clouds, but quickly scour those clouds out. So becoming mostly sunny by afternoon and then it's sunshine all the way through Friday, maybe Saturday. Temps going from the 60s up to near 70 there. Chance for showers and storms on Sunday with a pretty good cold front coming through. But or I'll tell you what, we have a spectacular stretch of weather coming up. And don't forget to set those clocks back Saturday night before you go to bed.